clue. Said this is me and my buddy. Deep one. I am back out with the X-Max, but this time I have paddle tires on it. We just got some snow. Unfortunately, it's melting pretty quick, so not sure how deep of snow we'll be able to test it out in, but should be fun anyway. Hannah has never driven this, so we're gonna let her kick things off with a blast through a snowman that she just built. I'm hoping I don't break the car, because I did build that snowman, and that snowball was heavy. You probably don't have to be wide open, but just see what happens. Okay. Oh. It did it. Destruction. Look at it. All that work. Really? <laughs> Gone in two seconds. Great job. You want me to go whoosh? Yeah, go whoosh. Around the berm. Okay. Some nice wood chips into a snow berm. We'll head into the woods from here. I said it reminds me of a bulldozer. A bulldozer, yep. <laughs> <laughs> Here's some deep stuff for you. Throw and roost. How's it feel so far? Like I'm bashing. <laughs> bashing at its best. <laughs> Fun little piece of the motocross track here. Probably just rollers, but maybe be able to double them. I gotta try this, see if I can double any of those. There's some roost. This is sweet with the paddles. Oh, there's not much lip on them going this way though. See if I can get anything coming back. No doubles, just some air time. We're looking for some air time on the stairs then. Can you go up them? Uh, I don't know about that much. Yep. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Did not expect that to work. Hannah's turn for some stair time, air time. Okay. You want me to jump it, huh? Yeah, you got to jump it. I did it. You made it look so easy. I mean, I got to really blast it, huh? You made that more. look way easier than it actually is. First crash. Come on, Hannah. Oh, so close. There you go. Use that power. <laughs> it almost got me. <laughs> Found a fun looking line here. See if I can get it to pivot. Uh, not quite as tight as I wanted to, but there's a nice jump to hit over here. There's how you get it to turn. Not sure if this is gonna work, but, oh, a little too steep maybe. Not quite, but still kind of a cool, up and fakey, to roosty. Ow! Ooh. Time for a big drop, if I can get enough traction for grip. Oh, a little harsh on the landing. Got some snow in the mouth too. This thing throws a lot of roost with those paddle tires. I don't think you can make it all the way up, but at least to the barrel and wherever that went. Wow. See if I can turn on this barrel. Kind of like that. I don't call that a good one. Paddle tires do not hook up all that well on wet barrels, believe it or not. Makes it a little tricky. I'll take that though. We have to make at least one double today, right? Oh no, I think the batteries are dead. This clipless body design is one of my favorite things about this. Not having to deal with body clips is pretty sweet. We're back and it is getting muddier by the minute. But I made the double. See if I can clean off a little bit of that mud with some snow roost. When that snow melts, it should just clean it right up, right? We're going to finish this session up with a little long jump challenge. See who can go the furthest off of a snow jump. Pat, what technique are you gonna use? W-O-T. What's that mean? Wide open throttle. <laughs> You can take as much run up as you want to. Wide open throttle's the technique, huh? That's all it takes. Let's see what you can do. Oh, nose bonk landing, but it counts. I think that's your mark right there. I'm going for mega run in. Let's see if it pays off. Oh, it gets kicked and it's hard to bring that front wheel up. Front wheels up, that is. There's two of them. You seriously just m made it past mine just by a little bit. Ooh. Well, kept it close. Way to go. I was somewhere around here, so only a few inches difference, really. That was your first experience with a big rig like the X-Max. It felt massive. 
oh, well, it's a lot heavier now, but the paddles seem to work really well in the snow. I would like to try it in some deeper stuff, but that's probably going to have to wait until next winter. For now, I'm going to go clean this up and wait for a warmer day to try to blast across the pond. All right, it is slightly warmer out, but it is really wet. It's been raining like crazy the past week. The pond is super full. I'm kind of nervous about jumping into that right away, but I'm gonna try out this little puddle first to see how it feels before going for a more dangerous one. Let's jump right into it. Oh, it does slow down quite a bit. You can feel that power drop across the water, but made it and broke it. <laughs> oh, and that is going to do it. The pinion slid off and chowed the spur gear real bad. I don't have any parts either, so that might have been the shortest RC session I've ever had. All right, I got the X-Max fixed up. It is not much warmer out today, but the snow is gone. Still a lot of water. The pond is super full. I'm going to start just with the corner here and see how that does before I decide how much I really want to risk it by going across the middle. Oh, that's not good. That was the quickest RC session I've ever had. So it turns out when I changed the spur, I lost a bearing. I replaced that and it seems to be holding up now. It's a little loud, but hopefully it'll be strong enough to get across some deep water. And third time will be the charm. A little warm up here, just a little bit of water. Oh yeah, no problem through that. A little deeper this time. <laughs> it actually does that quite easily. I found a nice straight shot here across a deeper spot. Nice flat run, but there is a bank on this side with a big hole right here. Hopefully I don't catch that, and hopefully I don't get stuck in the grass. Oh, looking good so far. A little jump out even, that's pretty sweet. Transfer line here. Oh, it bounced a bit. Here's a nice longer, straight, deep one. Hopefully it has the power. Oh yeah, right through the cattails and everything. Well, that was pretty sweet. I'm surprised how easily it crosses the water. There is a line I really want to do, but I'm going to save it for another time. I want to go to the island, jump the island, skim across again. But with the luck we've had so far, might wait for a warmer day just in case we have to go for a swim. For now, I'm going to give Hannah a turn. Here's a longer one. She's going to try a little bit of a turn in it. Keep going. Yeah, no problem. I did it. You did it. So what did you think? It was wild. Wild and fun. Paddles are a good time. So is a big truck like this. We're going to do some more some other time when it's a little bit warmer. But it's fun first run or runs with the paddles. <laughs>